Why should I actually buy this? What it, what can it absolutely help me with? It, so it absolutely helps with detox. Mm. It's one of the best uh, one-stop shop type of supplements for detox because it works in all three phases to get it from um, it taking the supplement. It actually can get it out and not just work in one phase, one of the three phases. It works in all three. And it's the best phase two detoxifier of any natural compound. What's going on, Wellness Beauties? Andrea here, your personal wellness connector, and welcome back to my channel. So today we're talking about broccoli sprouts. We're going through a product review, and broccoli sprouts really have been one of the hottest health trends over the past few years. So why broccoli sprouts? And not only why broccoli sprouts, but why broccoli? Here you go. It's a little uh, tough to see, but I am here with the founder of this product, and I'm so excited to have David here with us to talk about why broccoli and why, what I would say, you should stay away from probably all of the other broccoli sprouts products out there. So David, welcome. How are you? Hey, Andrea. Doing well. Thank you so much for having me. Of course. Thanks for being here. So let's get right into it. First of all, broccoli sprouts. Why it's, it's not really about the broccoli sprouts. It's about the sulfur-rich compound in the broccoli sprouts called sulforaphane. I always get it wrong, so I have to read it and slowly say it. You're like a master. You keep just sulforaphane, sulforaphane, SFN for short. What is it? Why is it important for our bodies? Yeah, so sulforaphane is uh, a natural compound from broccoli, and uh, it's found in other cruciferous vegetables, but highest in broccoli. And broccoli sprout, sprouts actually have 10, or actually 50 to 100 times more of the sulforaphane than mature broccoli. And so that's why people would sprout. Um, the problem with sprouting is some seeds actually have no uh, ability to grow sulforaphane. And so that's because there's a precursor chemical called glucoraphanin in, in the seeds or in the, in, that um, we found actually some, that some organic uh, broccoli seeds don't have any, um, and so they have no no uh, precursor chemical glucoraphanin to be able to make the um, sulforaphane. And so um, glucoraphanin is stable, um, sulforaphane is not stable. And so actually, if you have uh, the head of broccoli, you start chewing it, you break down the cell wall that releases an enzyme called morosinase, and that morosinase converts the glucoraphanin into sulforaphane. And so that's why. A, all of the um, broccoli supplements on the market have this precursor chemical. Sometimes it's uh, kind of nefariously or, or deceptively called sulforaphane glucosinolate. It's confusing, um, but that's glucoraphane. In, in fact, um, I before uh, yeah, I purchased a lot of sulforaphane glu glucosinolate, thinking that it was um, actually sulforaphane. I've had spoken with physicians. One cried with me because she was giving her patients sulfurifin glucosinolate, thought it was sulfurifin. And everyone brings their bottle and is like, well, is, you're saying this isn't sulfurifin? I'm like, it's not, it's, it's not, it's the precursor chemical. The problem with that is that only about 10% gets converted by your gut bacteria if you have the right gut bacteria. And so that's just not enough to make a clinical difference in, in turning on the NRF2 pathway. Yep. And number one, most of us do not have the right gut bacteria. Let's be honest. And number two, like you said, a lot of people will then go buy it. They hear about, you know, this compound, they go buy something on Amazon or online or in Costco, and then they don't really feel the difference. And they, you know, throw it out the window. This stuff doesn't work, right? I don't feel the difference on to the next. So that's why having an expert like you and talk about why you should be careful when choosing these supplements is a huge deal. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about like the, you told us a little bit about how it's difficult to get into our bodies, right? How do we get this historically? Like, how do we actually? Yeah. Like, historically, just eat, eating, eating broccoli or um, broccoli sprouts. And so before the uh, broccoli had existed, I would grow broccoli sprouts um, so that and juice them every day. Um, and the problem with that, you know, it's, it's, it's cheap. It's good. If you have the right, um, seeds, you're actually getting it. Um, and so, the, and so 
I always actually throw some radish seeds in with my broccoli um, <clears throat> as I'm growing uh, sprouting uh, broccoli seeds because the radish has is richer in the morosinase to convert it into sulfurethane. So a lot of people have done that, um, but I've heard people who have sprouted for years take our, our product and, and notice a difference from sprout from when they've sprouted. And so the, the, the capsule in broccoli actually has uh, a clinically relevant dose of sulfurethane and it's broccoli plus, and we add actually the cousin chemical PEITC, uh, which is from watercress. And that works in synergy with sulfurethane so that you actually get a five, three to five times effect and benefit from just doing it alone. Yeah. And honestly, there's nothing better like taking a supplement and actually feeling the difference, obviously. <laughs> yeah. um, tell me a little bit about the benefits, right? We talked about how hard it is to find a good supplement, one that actually works, one that you're absorbing. Tell me who this is for. If, you know, if I'm the woman listening, okay, it's like, why should I actually buy this? What, it, what can it absolutely help me with? It, so it absolutely helps with detox. It's mm -hmm. one of the best uh, one-stop shop type of supplements for detox because it works in all three phases to get it from um, it, taking the supplement. It actually can get it out and not just work in one phase, one of the three phases. It works in all three. And it's the best phase two detoxifier of any natural compound. Um, if you're, if you're uh, middle-aged, you have joint pain or um, it, it can really help with that. Um, if you're worried uh, about cognitive issues, it, it promotes uh, BDNF, brain derived neurotrophic factor, and can um, really pr uh, promote brain health. Um, and so it also works with, uh, there are different mechanisms of anti-aging, mm -hmm. works in autophagy, works in mitophagy, um, where you're clearing your body of dysfunctional cells and uh, mitochondria. Um, and then people who actually um, shouldn't take it are people who have uh, or take on um, or allergic to broccoli, which is kind of, I can't, I can't imagine how many people are like, I'm allergic to broccoli. Can I take broccoli? <laughs> no, don't. Stay that away. might be an excuse for like children. Mom, <laughs> I'm allergic. So, and then people who are on blood thinning medications, uh, it is a blood thinner. So it, you need to coordinate with your clinician about that. But, and, and also um, blood pressure medication. They can lower your blood pressure. And, and so you need to coordinate with your physician, physician if you're on a blood, uh, med, uh, blood pressure medication. Got it. I love it. And thank you for that. We also spoke about it being great for someone. You know, I'm putting my fiance on it because he works out a lot. So he's just naturally inflamed. So I know you said uh, a lot of people, athletes or people that are into fitness, that it might just reduce that inflammation load. Yeah, so uh, there's there are, um, athletes who are into recovery. Mm -hmm. Actually, uh, we have a small uh, kind of cult following who take it for that. They're like, I can exercise more. And then people um, who are looking for performance. So there's something called the Krebs cycle where you're turning glucose into ATP. It's like money in the bank versus the usable form of money, which is cash. So it's the use, ATP is the usable form of energy. Krebs cycle is how does that glucose get turned into ATP? And there are a number of different cofactors that kind of prime the pump in that. NAD is one of them. And so um, sulfurifen upregulates the NAD and really helps promote um, energy and so uh, and, and performance. So that's one, of, one thing people take it for as well. Yeah, I love it. And just to have something, you know, we're just bombarded with toxins and chemicals all day, every day. I don't care where you live. I mean, there might be very few exceptions. So it's just such a great product to take that it makes me feel safe that I'm detoxing on a daily basis without being overloaded. You know, we do a lot of like heavy metal and longer and stronger detoxes. This is just such a great tool to include in that, yeah. but also to have on a daily basis as a daily detox. Um, helping with inflammation, helping with brain function. So I absolutely love what your product is all about. And it really does be just, you know, eating a bunch of broccoli and broccoli sprouts every day, like you said, that might not even have the compound in there because you actually tested all of these seeds. So let's eat our broccoli because it tastes delicious and it's good for us. But let's make sure we're taking our broccoli on a daily basis to ensure we have the actual compounds that our body needs, right? 
There you go. That's right. <laughs> I love it. David, thank you for joining us for this product review. You're amazing. Such a pleasure getting to know you. And thank you for all your knowledge and what you do. Andrea, thanks for having me. Thanks so much, guys. And make sure you're subscribing for more product reviews like this.